Six. Four of silicate glass with a PEI coating. Right. <laughs> 
And these rails are not cheap. No, no. I mean, I was part of the beta run. This cost like twenty five hundred dollars, and he lost money. On it. And I, I just, you know, he just can't. Now, yeah, it's the way of things. Yeah. Yep. I must get there before it showed a, a different symbol that it showed the two devices were connected to each other. So, I always imagined it bigger. What, the M2? Yeah. No, it's a pretty normal, boring size. Yeah. I guess the scale of it in the pictures make it look a little larger than... Yeah, it's just an 8x10. Yeah, I mean, it's plenty big, it's, it's nice just... Size yeah, it just it looks bigger in the pictures, like, yeah. Well, yeah, when you see the picture, it's always kind of from down low. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, if you look at it from this, the picture will be a lot bigger. It's nice. Perf board. Mm -hmm. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Or no, you know all about this one. Don't you? Yeah. That's why this one. Version over here has handles. Yes. That's what I've got. <laughs> this is the. This is the. This is the first. The first one. This is the first one I've ever seen. And that, that blue one was made like three days ago and it's like production ready and we're, we're selling it this weekend if anybody wants. It's good. How much are you pay charging? So 1200 for, for the fully assembled uh, ready to go unit, $1,000 for the, uh, the cap. Wow. Yeah. Three, 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 three. Not so far. This whole row of people over here. I think you need to embrace, embrace the medium. Instead yeah. of trying to hide your layers, you that, bring it I mean, out. It, it's, it's just it's got a cool look to it. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people are using this, but not in a theater. Is this one kind of thing? Yes.
Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, move anything you need here. Right? So how do you get this bonded together? Is that a solder? No, that's just it's threaded. Just I didn't want to break it. Nope. Okay. And then do you have to do this on a, a mill to get that no, machine? No, this is on uh, screw machines. Okay. Uh, CNC. Yeah, yeah. I just wondered if you were able to make it's this not on screw. a screw. I'm sorry, Swiss. Sorry. Swiss. Uh, Swiss. Uh, is it lathe at all, or is it just milled? Um, those machines, yeah, they're basically Swiss Swiss lathes, but they have milling capabilities. They're multi-axis. Oh, okay, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. I'm not sure how many how many axes it has. And are you using a smaller cartridge on some models? Yeah. So this one will have the four millimeter. Okay. And then if you need the extra power, six millimeter, sixty watt. Okay, and this is what, 30 or 20? Uh, it's 20. Okay. But still, this guy heats up very quick. I bet, yeah, I mean, with no mass. Yeah. Um, and are you, have you ever looked into making an all metal out of brass? Uh, no, it wouldn't really work because of the thermal characteristics of the brass. Oh, that makes sense. The whole thing would heat up all the way. Yeah. This works because stainless isn't really thermally conductive as, as, as brass, so that helps us in this case. Okay. Okay, good. Let it cool? Is it cool already? No. So you put screw. Hold on to that. Is this a stainless steel heat sink? Yes. 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 Carbon fiber layout. Um, you want like a 40 to 50% uh, resin to carbon fiber uh, ratio. Okay. Right now we're closer to 60. So we're too carbon, we're too uh, resin rich. Okay. So it's a, it's a process, but in time we will get there and we're producing our own panels. Nice. So is this just a volcano you anodized? Yeah, that's, yeah, and, and, and probably the anodization will not hold on that. But like this is the uh, content of E3B6 in England, and I had.